Hey guys, it's Kristen and welcome back. Today I have week 15 of my pregnancy. Oh my goodness gracious, like seriously, I can't believe I'm already 15 weeks pregnant. I'm definitely starting to look pregnant and not just look like, you know, I got it on with a bag of donuts. So I have some notes here just so I could remember like what to tell you guys. Um, so I wouldn't forget because I feel like sometimes I forget things and then I wish that I would have included them and I usually go back and include them in the blog post. Um, but yeah, so anyway, let's just get started. So let's start with my symptoms of this week. Basically, I have had like really bad lower back pain, like worse pain than I have felt up until this point. Um, I actually had pain similar to this when I was like seven months pregnant with my oldest. This has just gotten um, very uncomfortable, so I'm definitely taking more warm baths in the evening, and I am using my heating pad, you know, like 10 minutes on, 10 minutes off. I'm taking Tylenol, and that all seems to really help, but it's like, you know, resting is the only thing that really helps, and with a 10-month-old, well, he's almost 10 months, um, any day now, uh, it's really hard to like sit and rest. So I've also had sciatic nerve pain, which it's, it's still continuing. I've just been having it more, like it was kind of sporadic and now it's like I'm getting it pretty much every day, every other day. It's basically, you know, it's in my lower back area but it's going into like my left butt cheek and down like into my left thigh in the back. And it's actually quite funny. I mean, it hurts like crap, like don't get me wrong. It's very uncomfortable, but it's kind of funny because it just reminds me of like that typical like Charlie horse pain that it's like you don't, you can't do anything about it. So, you know, whatever. Um, I've had um, my headaches. My headaches are back at night and I don't get a headache all day long. At first I thought it was like caffeine or something like that that was doing it to me. So I tried drinking caffeine like I bought like the little baby bottles of coke and I was drinking like one in like the afternoon um and that's not working so it's not like a lack of caffeine headache um it's just I don't know what it is so it's just pregnancy and it's just been giving me a headache but Tylenol definitely you know um has been taking care of that and every once in a while I take a Tylenol with a Benadryl if I know that um you know my husband is going to be able to, to wake up at night with my son my husband's a really heavy sleeper so it makes me nervous um he can sleep like through a freight train like coming through our bedroom so it makes me nervous that he wouldn't hear my son I hear you know him at like you know, I don't even have to have the monitor on. I can have my door shut and I can hear my son breathing deep. So I'm a very light sleeper when it comes to, you know, being able to hear my kids and stuff. And anyway, so yeah, the headaches have been like kind of annoying, but what are you going to do, right? You just, <laughs> you just deal with it. Um, okay. So cravings this week have been orange juice. Um, and not just like any kind of orange juice. It's that simply orange orange juice. Like that's the only orange juice that I want to drink that I want to drink. I don't know if I if for, to me it tastes different um, than other orange juice. And that's probably like one of those things that's like pregnancy crazy because it probably doesn't taste any different if I was to taste it. You know, in eight months from now, it would probably all taste the same. Um, but yeah, it just tastes better than most of the other orange juices and in all actuality I used to drink that Trop 50 like the watered down half sugar orange juice and I'm probably craving like the sugar or something like that I don't know but um, I'm craving orange juice that's really all that I want to drink so so that's pretty much it I've just been pretty much dealing with the headaches and the back aches and just the typical joys of pregnancy I am definitely enjoying the fact that I am starting to look pregnant um it's funny because I look way more pregnant at night. Um, if you guys are not following me on Instagram, I'm gonna start posting pictures on Instagram, like side by side, like morning shots and night shots, um, and just like other things that I'm like, pur baby purchases or stuff like that. I'm gonna start posting all that stuff on my Instagram. If you guys just wanna follow me on Beauty Moxie on Instagram, then that would be super cool. And yeah, all my links are always below. So if you guys are looking for me on Facebook or something like that, I don't have anything that says, you know, this channel, everything is my beauty moxie name along with Twitter and stuff like that. But I am going to start posting more stuff. And I did just join Keek. Yeah, I thought that would be pretty fun to do some daily, like, I don't know, whatever you do on Keek. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure that out. My name is, on, is Beauty Moxie on there as well. 
still trying to figure that out. It's like, you know, if you finally get down one thing, like I finally under like, not that I understand, but it's like I can finally get down managing like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and then they throw something else at you. So anyway, I've had a lot of requests from my other channel to get on Keek, so I don't know if you guys are interested in that. But I also want to do stuff for, you know, with my pregnancy and everything like that, and, um, you know, do all of that. I don't know, guys, what that just was. Don't mind me, I'm, I feel like I'm starting to become delirious at this point. So I need to get out of my house and do some stuff. Oh, just quick update. I still have not decided what I'm gonna do about the sex of the baby yet. I'm still really, really on the fence. Um, so I'm having my ultrasound supposedly in four weeks. We will see when they can get me in and get me scheduled. And I tried to make an appointment the other day. Um, they were like, well, you're going to have to call back in about a week or we're going to have to call you back in about a week um, to schedule your appointment. So. Okay, so I'm going to show you my belly. As you can see, my boobs have gotten pretty big. Um, I'm definitely starting to look pregnant when I'm wearing my clothes. And then this is my tummy. You can see it's popping out down here at the bottom. And yeah, I'm definitely looking pregnant. I'm actually 16 weeks right now, but I'm definitely looking pregnant. Um, I do have a another doctor's appointment coming up and I have testing and stuff like that so anyway that is it I hope that I didn't ramble too much I tried to use my notes and keep track of what I was going to be talking about this week and so and I started doing that for next week's video as well so I will talk to you guys in my next video bye